What's good, YouTube? Benny here, bringing you my uh, Elite One rewards. Actually, this week, no, no top 100. Sadly, I uh, finished 27 and two. Had two early losses really early on. I had one in the second game in which I lost on pennies, which was ridiculous. And then I lost one at like 14 and one. Well, I had like 10 shots, well, more than 10 shots on target, and you know, it's just one of them games where the luck wasn't with you. I can see the 120th minute David Luiz, uh, uh header back post, but it is what it is. It was going to go to penalties, you never know what happens in penalties. Um, but that's not really too much of an issue for me personally, as I, as long as I get uh, 27 and get my 10 pro points, uh, it's usually a successful weekend. Um, but obviously we know Elite Ones obviously is not as good as Top 100 for making coins. Um, but, you know, sometimes we're going to have to take an L uh, to take a W, I hope, uh, really. Uh, hopefully maybe Elite Ones usually better, well, is better than uh, Top 100. I've seen most of the time when I've seen Top 100 rewards, it's always terrible anyway. So um, you see my rewards is not very good. Um so yeah, looking at the team of the week, it's not bad. It's not good though. There's a lot of like really nice like informs like this Ben Yellow's really nice. Um, this Julian Brent centre mid car is really nice. Sterling really good. Um, this Pepe another good play. So there's a lot of like good options. I didn't even realise Jamie Valley's on the bench. Well, um, so there's a few good options, but obviously. I think if I had my top 100 pack, I wouldn't be opening it. But with Elite One, I will be opening it just because it's Elite One. You know, your luck's in or it's not. Simple as. Um, I will do the red pick, show you the team what I did use for the weekend. Uh, sorry, not what I did use for the weekend. What I'm going to be using for the following weekend because of new requirements for qualifiers. We've got another qualifier this weekend, the LQE. Um... It's only like eight spots for Europe, so it's going to be super hard to qualify for. Um, but we're going to give it our best, obviously. Hopefully, if we get that, like, I'd be so shocked, to be honest with you, because it's so hard to actually get in. Um, but that one's in America, which would be dope to actually get to. Um, so... Let's get into these red picks. Don't forget to let me know what you guys get in your red picks as we get Julian Brent in the first one. He's not a bad, like... If you played narrow and used him as a left centre mid, he'd be pretty solid. But yeah, um, let me know what you get in your red picks. See if you got some same some luck. I was gonna say same luck as me, but not when you get two of the same player. I can't believe that's still a thing when you pick a player. It uh, look, I've got him in three picks there. That's ridiculous. Like you should once you pick that player, it should disappear from your red options. In my opinion, like there should be no reason that guy popped up three times, but is what it is. That's the reward system this year. You know, it's not very, very good to be honest with you. It's uh, it's been appalling. But this is the team I currently have. I will be changing a few things out for the qualifiers though, as I, as it's not actually hitting the requirements at the moment. Such as this uh, Van der Sar and Uo have to leave. We already have Allison, and then I just need to buy an inform pop at 89 um, to go left centre mid. And this is the team I will be using in the qualifiers if you want to know beforehand. Um, maybe Dembele changes, I'm not really too sure. He didn't really perform too well yesterday. Um, but it is what it is, you know, probably whoever I put there, as long they have to be under 89 rated, whoever I put there. Um, isn't going to perform. It can't be an icon either, so that's a bit disappointing. We'll do the ultimate packs first, and then the team, uh, then the hundreds, and then the team of the weeks. Um, already better than last week's video, uh, though. That right there, as we get a walkout Italian centre mid. I don't even. Oh, for a. Yeah, because last week we we took the ultimate packs in the hundred K packs. I don't even think we got one walkout. Um, I think there was a few packs without a ball. I think there was a pack without a ball, which was crazy. Um, but that's not bad, you know. Another player for an SBC once they actually drop a decent one, you know. They they've dropped a few okay ones, I would say, uh, this week with this new uh, carnival, um, what's it called, carnival promo. There has been a few decent cards as we get a French Cam Fakir, 
Um, so it's just, we had like Socrates come out, Desai, um, um, but just they're not like the top tier ones. Like Socrates is very good. I see a lot of people using him camera and saying they really like him there. So if you're looking for like a big icon to use, maybe just do that one stop waiting for like these hullets and ronaldos and whatnot because we actually have no idea when they are coming out but uh I, i'm just still unsure why they haven't released these cards at the end of the day um where where what what are we in february march march oh my god we're in march um and we haven't even seen one good icon which is ridiculous I think um, the fact that we have none I think last year like basically all of them out was made apart from like R9, Pele, Hullet and I think there was one more like a Maldini or something but the rest were uh, the rest were out like there's a Ronaldinho and whatnot as we do get a walkout in our 100k um, but yeah I, I'm still unsure so we get a left mid Croatian Perisic um, Actually, no, last week we got Modric, didn't we? I think, from our 100k. So I might have been wrong. I did lie then. Uh, it was from the Orma packs. We didn't really receive anything, but... Yeah. Uh, I, I forgot I got Modric last week. That's obviously quite bad of me, because uh, I usually... I, I sometimes complain about packs, so if you forget like what you've been given, it's uh, not obviously the best. We go for the Team of the Week packs. I don't really see much coming from these. Um... To get no walkout, I, pop oh, I was just probably gonna discard them, but in, you know, just I would just list them just in case. Uh, 82 rate, I think. Let me know what you guys get in your rewards. I have obviously asked what you got in your reds, but let me know what you just got in your rewards in general. Um, see if you've got better than what I have for whatever you finish. Because oh, at the moment, I don't think this is very good. I this is a waste of a weekend, really, if it wasn't for the pro points. Um, as we do get a walkout this time, though. Can we see, like, the England flag maybe to turn this pack open around? Italian, I don't even know who it is. A mobile? But Bellotti, I think. 86. 86 in form. Bellotti will take it since whatever we was having anyway. So, And an 84, so double walkout. That's not bad. Um, better than what obviously last pack was but yeah that'll be it for the video guys don't forget to do a like comment subscribe and peace